Dems totally regretting not abolishing the debt limit. There appears to be a growing sense of regret within the Democratic ranks that the party missed an opportunity to neutralize the debt limit threat when they fully controlled the Congress and White House two years ago. Senator Tim Kaine of Virginia, Tim Kaine in the membrane, Tim Kaine in the brain of Virginia, told Politico that if you... I'm sorry, I can't believe I just did that. That's a real thing that happened, by the way. Uh, that if he could do one thing, it would have been raising the debt ceiling, uh, debt limit late last year. Democratic Senate aide vented the semaphore that the debt ceiling could have been raised in the American Rescue Plan or in reconciliation during last year's lame duck session. Okay, now I have to play it because you guys think I made up that thing. Now I have to, I'm sorry, you asked for this. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. There are ten things you need to do. Number one. You register to vote and it's on. You post that Hillary sign up on your lawn. Number two. Call some undecideds with your crew. Your cousins in Ohio maybe try and flip them blue. Number three. Watch Hillary examine the terrain. Watch a campaign with the man Tim Kaine. Ah, uh, Tim Kaine in the membrane. Tim Kaine in the brain. We deserve Donald Trump for this, okay? Like, straight up. This is why we got Donald Trump. America deserved Donald Trump, dude. Fuck it, I'm saying it. This is why. This is literally why. Before. Hillary makes each decision Looking at the world from a rarefied position A public servant with tenacity, agility Mi gente, experience, experience is not a liability. liability Five, now we all know this is the time When the yep. other side tries to fly low, we go high We know that our Hillary's no quitter We watch as our opponent sits and fiddles with his Twitter Seven Confession time all in a burst I wanna vote the candidate Puts our kids first. November 8th. Your last chance to participate. Roll up to your polling place. Vote up in your home state. What happened to the audio? And it's down to the nitty gritty. Three weeks to go. Are, Are you, you ready, ready, New York City? City? Yes. In a world gone berserk. Hillary rolls up his sleeves and goes to work. work. I have only one overwhelming feeling. Anybody here want to shatter a glass ceiling? Nine. Look, Look them in the eye, clear, clear your throat. Sum in all the time you can devote. Then count. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Number ten, ten paces, paces vote. Damn, dude. My favorite part about this, and there are plenty, okay? I mean, what isn't the best part? But my favorite part about this is, like, the intensity in Lin-Manuel Miranda's face as he's like spitting these bars, you can tell in his mind he's going, oh my God, dude, everyone is going to fucking love this shit. Like the way he, the way he just raps is like, like when he's delivering like the final note, he's just like, like the Tim Kane in the memory. This is the time when the other side tried. Like, sorry, fuck. <laughs> sorry for that. Here, this is the best part. You have to see this. You have to see this again. The man Tim Kaine, ah, uh, Tim Kaine in the membrane, Tim Kaine in the brain. No. So good. Now I'm not gonna play the fight song again, okay? Only because, like, if I play the fight song, I'll just break into song and dance. Anyway, where the fuck were we? What did this guy say? We just came in, talked to shit, moved on. You know what I mean? Nice. I think your exact quote from three years ago was that it looked like Lin-Manuel was about to come. I was just watching your old reaction not 30 minutes ago. Wait, shut the fuck up. Are you serious? Link me the video of me looking at this. Mm. 
You had this combo almost this time Rare last year. Hasanavi compilation. No, where's the Tim Kane in the membrane? This isn't it. Bit liberal. This is not Tim Kane in the membrane, Tim Kane in the brain. This is not that. Is this the right one? Oh. Democratic Oh, here, here, here. Ready. Three weeks to go. Are, Are you, you ready, ready, New York City? City? Yes, in the world gone berserk. Hillary rolls up his sleeves and goes to work. work. Hey. I have only one overwhelming feeling. Anybody here want to shatter, shatter a glass, glass ceiling? ceiling? Look, Look them in the eye, clear your throat. throat. Summon all the time yeah. you can the vote. Then count Get my boys popping off, five, dude. Six, seven, eight, nine, number ten, ten paces vote. vote. Just look at his, look at Lin-Manuel Miranda's face. He's like, on oh God, I'm about to nut dude <laughs> watch, watch, watch yes in the world gone berserk hillary rolls up his sleeves he's and he's goes like, to work hey. i have only one overwhelming feeling anybody here want to shatter a glass ceiling no. Look Look them in the the eye, clear. <laughs> i don't know what i did but i'm sorry please end this <laughs> yeah you're the same guy still? I mean, yeah, straight up. Everything is the same. Like, literally everything is the same. In his song, Rope My Way Out, he describes being bullied for his writing, and honestly, they should have bullied him more. Yeah. Okay, let's, let's move on. Let's uh, move away from this dumb shit, okay? Um...